It is the great American eclipse, and this is what we have been waiting for. It is not nighttime, it is daytime, but it has gotten very dark in Del Rio, Texas. Uh, take a look. Uh, full totality is happening. We've got Allie Bradley there on the ground. Allie, what's, what's it like? Okay. Oh my gosh, you guys, just goosebumps from head to toe. I know people experience weird things. This is wild, Brian. I have never experienced anything like this. I mean, the energy is palpable. You can feel it with everybody here looking up at this darkness. I mean, the, the sun is gone. This is crazy. We have full totality right now in Del Rio, Texas. We are the first spot in the United States to experience this. You guys are experiencing it with us. Look at all these people. There are thousands of people here in Del Rio. You can see some of their phones lit up. Hey, yeah, you got it, guys. We got people from all over, Brian. So I talked to some people from Tucson, but I just talked to a guy from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, who's down here because this was the best place to see totality. Of course, we have cloud cover. That doesn't matter, apparently, because it is dark. You cannot see anything out here. It feels like nighttime. It's nighttime, it's nighttime. right? It's nighttime. It's nighttime out here. So we have a bunch of different bands playing. We have the Spasmatics getting ready to go on. The Del Rio Jazz Band has been performing. We have Mariachi down here. It's a full party down here, Brian. And it's important, too, to these people in Del Rio because I've been talking to a lot of them. I do the border. I cover the border. So I know these people from three years ago because what put them on the map then was the crisis where we saw nearly 16,000 people under that bridge. So they were kind of ground zero for the immigration crisis. Now we're ground zero for totality. How cool is that? Way to rewrite history here for this small border community and show that they still thrive and survive despite the issues that they face every single day down here. They've got other things going on. They have lives to live. They have eclipses to watch. So they've been planning this for two years here in the city of Del Rio. The mayor telling us this is a good economic boost for them. They expect around 10,000 people to be here today. There's a lot of people here and they're excited and they're energized and they didn't know what to expect. And after we're done here, I'm not pulling anybody, Brian. I'm not gonna pull anybody away from this experience, but after it happens, I'm gonna talk to them and find out what they felt. Uh, a lot of people talked about how they might cry or have an emotional kind of experience. And so the things are moving slowly, right? And let's see, can you, does my shirt look any different? Because there's something that goes on with this phenomenon when you are red or green, Brian, that if you're wearing red, the red apparently gets darker. If you're wearing green, it gets shiny, it kind of gets brighter. So do we notice anything? I don't know. I don't know if it worked. I got a light on me. It but still I'm looks a little green. It's it just so cool, Allie. I mean, I even have goosebumps. I feel like I'm talking to you and it's nighttime. I'm forgetting that it's the afternoon. Is it, is it, we always hear that it gets like a little cooler. Did the temperature change? Yeah, so let me pull up my, my app here to see, because I just checked about 10 minutes ago where the weather was. So let's see if it has dropped down at all. Yeah, so 10 minutes ago when I checked, it was 84 degrees. Now it's 80. So it dropped about four degrees just because of this eclipse. So really interesting to see, but just wild. Like you said, it's not nighttime. You see up in the corner of our screen, it says it's 1.31 p.m. That is the reality, guys. Don't adjust your, your television screens. But we have people all over just staring at it. Let me, let me see, I'm gonna talk to this little kid. Hold on one second. Come over here. Hey, come here. What's your name? Hunter. Hi, Hunter. What did you think? It's cool. It's cool. Hunter says it's cool. Are you from Del Rio, Hunter? Yes. Yeah, he's from Del Rio. What, what do you think about the party? I really like it. You really like it? All right, Hunter, right on, man, get back to it. Get up there. All right, so Hunter's excited. Everybody in Del Rio is excited that we've talked about and talked to here again. It gets, it gets that opportunity to kind of rewrite history for them, and here we go. The sun's coming back, uh, not the golden arches, the other, other gold thing in the sky. So and I Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.